Did you know in the late 30s and 40s you could pay one dollar to ask three questions to a psychic horse? That horse was called Lady Wonder. She is said to have helped the police find a missing boy, predicted the winner of three boxing matches and aided in the discovery of oil. She had been trained to operate a device with levers connected to alphabet cards. She'd pull the various levers with her mouth and eventually spell out words, names and answers to questions about the past, present and future. Renowned psychical researcher J. B. Rhine investigated and concluded that there was evidence of ESP between humans and horses. But as a man with an intense desire to keep getting funding for his psychic research, he would say that, wouldn't he? The truth was discovered by magician Melbourne Christopher. He was a former president of the Society of American Magicians, an honorary vice president of the UK's Magic Circle, and one of the founding members of the Committee for Skeptical Inquiry. He investigated Lady Wonder and noticed that the phenomenon was the result of cueing from her trainer. Not the kind of cueing that was letting clever Hans know the answer to the mathematical questions, but the intentional kind of cueing. He observed that Lady Wonder only answered questions correctly when her trainer, Fonda, was aware of the answer. According to Melbourne Christopher, Lady was trained to move her head back and forth above the board bearing the letters. When she was over the right lever, a slight movement of Mrs. Fonda's stick cued her to lower her head and touch the proper lever. So, like clever Hans, Lady Wonder was a well-trained horse and sensitive to her human companions, but she was not psychic. <laughs>